Welcome back, guys. Happy Friday. Starting off the day with a cup of coffee in the not-so-unusual way, right? A tablespoon of sugar-free creamer and a little bit of liquid stevia. This is my morning fuel, my jet fuel that I need to start my day. Moving on to breakfast, I made myself a sandwich this morning consisting of two eggs, a slice of turkey bacon, and some peppers all mixed together, different colors, and this is the turkey bacon. So one slice is one point. The eggs are zero. The veggies are zero. Here's the macros for those interested. And what I'm going to do is do the avocado mash cups. I buy these at BJ's, but I know they sell them at Costco and all different types of grocery stores. You just have to look for them. It's, this is the macros for them. These are two points for the entire package. And they're a great way to not waste regular avocados. Actually, it's cost effective to buy it this way. The bread I'm using is the Old Time 647. This bread is phenomenal, delicious, and very low point. So what I'm doing is spreading on the avocado mash onto the toast. I like my bread lightly toasted, as you can see. And then I just assemble the sandwich. So it's basically the two eggs on one piece of bread, the turkey bacon on the other with a little bit of veggie on top. And away I went. And let me tell you guys, it was really, really good. It was the perfect way to start off a busy Friday because Fridays for me are always busy. I'm tying up all of the patients that I got for the week, tying everything up together so that everything is ready to go for next week. Here's my sandwich. I'm going to put the points up here for you. It comes out to six points. I have no problem eating a six-point breakfast. In fact, I really like to have a nice hearty breakfast so that it keeps my day full and not looking for treats throughout the morning. All right, packing lunch to take with me to work. This is one can of white meat chicken, so it's zero points. I used two tablespoons of this Trader Joe's red pepper spread. The flavor on this is absolutely amazing. Please go buy a bottle of this. It is so good. You won't regret it. It's a low point also. Mix that with the chicken in a bowl. I'm going to bring one of these caramel rice cakes with me uh, to add some sweetness to the savory. And I also chopped up some English cucumber on top. I put it in a Tupperware lid, and this way it's so portable. I'm just going to throw it in a lunchbox and go. But this is lunch. Here's the point values, and I'm heading out the door, guys. All right, it's snack time, and I have been enjoying one of these Premier Proteins almost every day. It's got 30 grams of protein. It comes in at 160 calories. That is all. Here's the macros for you. As you can see, the carbs are very low and it is just an absolutely delicious snack and it will keep you full for hours. Moving on to dinner. This was so outrageous. I couldn't wait to share it with you. Please try this. This is two tablespoons of queso. You can buy it any brand. Two tablespoons is one point. I'm using some turkey meatballs that I got from Trader Joe's and the hearts of palm that I got from Trader Joe's. Here's what I did. I put everything in a Pyrex dish. I cooked it for five minutes. Then I added the two tablespoons of the cheese sauce and I mixed it up. When I tell you this was like mac and cheese with some meatballs in it, I kid you not, it was delicious. I am gonna make this on a consistent rotation. I don't know why I never thought of this before, but it was absolutely wonderful enjoyed it very, very much. And again, the points values are so low. Let me share that with you right now. All right, guys, so there's the point value, nine, which makes me still have three points for the rest of the day. So that means if I wanna have another snack later, I can, but honestly, between the Premier Protein and this meal, I'm tapped out for the day, and right now it is almost 8 o'clock at night, so I don't really foresee myself eating anymore. Again, another reason why Weight Watchers is so perfect. For those of you who struggle with nighttime eating, you can eat a meal like this at the end of the night and feel completely full well into the morning hours. So anyway, guys, that's it for today. I love you all. I will see you in my next video. Have a wonderful night.